Welcome back to Weatherproofing America. Today we're going to go over roof ventilation. When it comes to the exhaust vents, there are many different types. We are going to cover the most popular ones. Ridge vent, turbines, static vents, and electrical vents. Ridge vent is one of the best types of ventilation as long as you have enough ridge to properly ventilate the attic space as well as you have a pretty good wind speed in your area. Turbines are a great option as well, however you need enough wind speed to make them work adequately. They are a great option if you're in tight spaces and need to ventilate large attic spaces. Static vents are probably my least favorite option because they rely solely on heat rising. They don't really work any better depending on the wind speed and you need many of them to make the roof ventilate properly. Electrical vents are my favorite option simply because they ventilate a large area of attic space with very few of them and they're very energy efficient. They have thermostat and humidistat options that will come on and off as needed. We're going to show you a roof that we just fixed the ventilation on. It's real similar to these roofs next door. It's, if you notice, it's got ridge vent on the lower ridges as well as the upper ridges. The one directly across the street has ridge vent and that wasn't enough so they put a electrical vent on the back side of it as well. So now all of this is competing with each other. So the house across the street for example, all of the ridge vent that is lower than that electrical vent will now become the intake instead of the exhaust. So instead of the air coming in at the sockets around the perimeter, the air is going to come in the ridge vents and suck out through that electrical exhaust vent because that's pulling a lot of air. And so uh, airflow is going to go to where it's the least resistance. And those ridge vents at the top are going to be the least resistant to the airflow. So therefore they're going to become the intakes. So what we did on this home is we removed the ridge vents that are lower than this upper one. And we removed the upper ridge vent as well because you don't want to have competing exhaust vents. And we installed three electrical vents. These vents have humidistats and thermostats on them. So they will come on and off on their own and be very energy efficient and only come on when they're needed. 